Hi friends, I just want to come on and give you guys a quick peek into these Lakeshore Learning notebooks that I bought. This guy I got at the Goodwill for 99 cents and um, I will give it to my son who is 7. So let me show you what the inside looks like. If any of you guys are considering getting any of these books, you have a first hand peek of what's on the inside. So on this cover, it tells the different kinds of writing, and I like that. Then here, there's a checklist for revising and for editing. Then on each page, there is the writing prompt. There's a word bank of suggested words to include in the writing and there is a spot for illustrations and more for writing so right throughout the book that's what it is then at the back there is this page that tells um, commonly misspelled words and overused words and I like this because he will now look and see, okay, instead of using good, I could probably say fantastic, wonderful, etc. So I like that. So that's for that. Now these two I bought directly from Lakeshore Learning. Um, this was on, was on sale for, I believe, $1.99. But I know it's less than $2. It was on sale. And um, in the past we've been just using a um, regular sheet that I made that you know they would list their um, the books they read and to give it a rating so this uh, year I think I'm gonna have him use this because I like it and then I'm gonna show you on the inside and I think you're gonna like it too so it tells you how to use the book um, uh, what are you reading and it you know, defines the different genres of books, and I like that. I really do. Then here is where the fun begins. It has the mapping for the story. So this will help him, you know. He identifies the main characters and um, the problems and all that. Which I think is good, because I'm trying to develop his writing. So I think this is good. And then you write a book review on the same book. And then here, same book, you have a journal page, uh, a spot for illustration again, and then, you know, he could write a few things about the book, which I like. And right throughout, that's what this is. Then in the back, there are these stickers and um, this reading log. You write the title of the book, the day that the book is uh, completed, well, the day he finished reading the book, <laughs> and what kind of book it was. So, that's that. And this one, I think, I'm just going to be using it as a reference point for writing. I'm not going to have anyone write in this one. Um, so, tell us how to use the book, what good readers do. Again, the different genres, how to find the right book, or finding the right book. And there's a log. I may just copy this and give to each of my girls. And we'll use um, this kind of reading log going forward. Then here it has the elements of fiction. Little um, pointers responding to fiction. Then this one has um, over here elements of nonfiction. Also, how to respond. So, that's it for these. Thank you guys for watching. Uh, see you in the next video.
you haven't done so yet, please subscribe to our channel. See you guys. Bye.